Hi everyone, in this video we will see how to do correlation from a geometer variable. Okay, so first uh, I had a third group and the third group I have a dummy sampler. So I am using this dummy sampler just to add preprocessor, just to add post processor, not pre, it's a post processor. Just we can do add any other post processor here. So, but uh, just to we and without a sampler, we can add a post processor. But if you add a post processor uh, uh, to third group directly, uh, it will work. It will work for all the requests under your third group. So to add that, I'm adding my uh, JSON extractor under my dummy sampler, and I have take. I have assigned my value. I have assigned a value. Uh, assigned a value in variable in test plan. So. I have double code here, so I'll remove the double code now. So from the variable p underscore uh, p underscore test data, p underscore test data, I'm going to pull the variable value of age and car. Okay, so now uh, I've added the dummy sampler. So in the in the JSON extractor, I'm checking the button, radio button, and geometer variable name to use. So the variable name what I have used here. Is p underscore test data so i'm copying the same variable here that should be without brackets so generally uh, geometer variable will be used like this but we should not use the dollar here dollar and a floor bracket here so geometer internally reads the variable name from the map key value from the map and it gets this is the key now it will get all the data from your variable in geometer internally and it applies a expression what you're writing in your script to get the value so and the correlated value is like c underscore h i'm keeping c underscore h that uh, expression will be i'm giving it an age uh, first occurrence and the default value is any uh, now run it i'm not saving the test now if you see that how it was done okay we forgot to add debug sampler so let's add debug sampler here so rerun the, uh, re the script again so now we got dummy sampler in the response data we got 30 the value so it is picking some so the p underscore test data is having the value and from from this variable we have taken the c underscore age as a variable and we added our uh, json path extractor so we can add any post processor so which supports uh, uh, reading the value we capture the value from variable so we have regular expression extractor, we have a boundary, we have a boundary extractor, which have a name, we have a regular expression which have a name, and we have XPath also. We have XPath extractor, which will have an option for the reading from the name. So we can have multiple, multiple processors, which suits for our requirement. So how we have seen how to, how to uh, capture a value or how to add a correlation, do a correlation from a geometer variable. Okay, thanks for listening friends.